What's going on guys, it's Jerome Mon and welcome back to another episode of NBA Kicks. This is the show where we go over the 10 best sneakers worn in the NBA from the past week. If you like basketball and you like sneakers, this is the show for you. So don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell so you never miss an episode of NBA Kicks which airs every single Monday. So now that you got it, let's go get it. Starting off this week's list at number 10, we have Chris Paul with the Air Jordan 4 tattoo. Now, Chris Paul didn't actually play in a game with the tattoo colorway of the Air Jordan 4 due to a sore left leg, but these were too hot for me to leave off this week's list. The red, white, and black color scheme goes perfectly with the Rockets' red uniforms, or in CP's case, the Rockets' warm-ups, but nonetheless, CP definitely brought out the heat here and starts off this week's list strong. Coming in at number 9, we have LeBron James with this colorway of the Nike LeBron 16. Now this colorway of the LeBron 16 could easily make this list on visuals alone. I mean the Laker themed purple and gold color scheme suits a LeBron 16 very well and I'm loving those leather hits on the tongue and the heel but what makes this colorway special is the message on the heel cup which showcases the LeBron James family foundation. We all know LBJ has done a ton for his community of Akron, Ohio and his foundation has been a huge part of that community so it's great to see that he's still representing despite playing thousands of miles away in LA and it just goes to show you, you can take the boy out of Akron but you can't take Akron out of the boy. Next up at number 8 we have Langston Galloway with the Hey Arnold custom of the specialist from Q4 Sports. Now Langston Galloway is no stranger when it comes to customs on the court, especially customs that show off his favorite cartoons and this week Langston and I have something in common because Hey Arnold was one of my childhood favorites. Gerald and Arnold are shown doing their iconic handshake on top of a vibrant orange and seafoam upper which make these really hard to miss out there on the hardwood but I challenge you to name a more iconic duo than Gerald and Arnold in terms of crazy hairstyles. Next up at number 7 we have Thon Maker with a Lion King custom of the Adidas Crazy Explosive 2017. The trailer for the 2019 version of the Lion King just dropped online not too long ago and it seems to have gotten the Bucks big man hype for the retelling of the Disney classic which for my money is the greatest Disney movie of all time and I would love to hear you try and find me about that in the comment section below but first let's just appreciate the kicks which have this really cool night and day theme going on and also displays some iconic visuals from the original Lion King which again is the greatest Disney movie of all time. Coming in at number 6 we have Kyrie Irving with a new colorway of the Nike Kyrie 5. Kyrie's newest signature model just dropped during Thanksgiving so be prepared to see a lot more colorways of the Kyrie 5 pop up because Nike always hooks Kyrie up with a ton of player exclusives throughout the season like the one that Kyrie wore during his game against the Cleveland Cavaliers. The marbled heel cup and lotus flytrap lacing system coupled with the gradient swoosh and black upper make for a very unique colorway that I'm sure fans of the Kyrie 5 will want Nike to release. So take this moment to tell Nike how you really feel in the comment section below. Next up at number 5 we have Damian Lillard with a special colorway of the Adidas Dame 4. Now we all know Dame is known for silencing the crowd with clutch plays during Dame time and I'm sure he silenced a couple of hecklers as well which he tells us here with a zipped up mouth emoji on top of a white colorway of his 4 signature model which is clean, simple and savage all at the same time. Next up at number 4 we have Montrez Harrell with a supreme custom of the Reebok Answer 4. Allen Iverson's Answer 4s were some of the most comfortable pairs of shoes I've ever worn thanks to its DMX cushioning system so it's great to see Montrez rock a pair on the court especially in this crazy Louis Vuitton Supreme custom that definitely complements Montrez's energetic personality and play style. At number 3 we have Montrez Harrell with a good burger custom of the Air Jordan 13. Yep you heard that right Montrez is on this week's list back to back. How could I not put these on this week's list? I mean look at them. Not only is the custom work here A1 with that hilarious artwork of Keenan and Kel, but Good Burgers is one of my favorite bad movies of all time and I just remember renting that orange cassette tape back in the day on a two night rental and watching it 12 times in those two nights. Welcome to Good Burger, home of the Good Burger, can I take your order? <laughs> Next up at number 2 we have Montrez Harrell with a cause custom of the Air Jordan 12. Yep, you heard that right. Montrez is on this week's list back 
to back to back. I don't know what to do. Montrez is on fire this season, and it seems like he wears a new pair of shoes every game and could pretty much have his own list of top five sneakers that he wore throughout the week. So I have to give props where props is due because no matter how unfair it may seem, these cause customs are just too wavy for me to ignore. I'm absolutely loving that gray color scheme with the cause artwork throughout the upper and a little splash of color on the lateral overlay is just the icing on the cake and really make this colorway look like a legit cause and Jordan collab which we have seen before on the Air Jordan 4 but I think it's time for the sequel. Jordan brand. Make it happen. Finally at number one we have Kelly Oubre with this crazy custom of the Air Jordan 15. Now Tinker Hatfield, legendary designer of multiple iconic Air Jordans, is on record calling the Air Jordan 15 his worst design, but this custom worn by Kelly Oubre honestly make it look like one of Tinker's best. The Japanese style artwork suits the Air Jordan 15 extremely well, especially since that woven material on the upper give this custom an authentic painting-like feel, and I just flat out love this style of artwork and have always been one of my favorite paintings throughout history, so you know I had to give these a number one spot as the best sneaker worn during the seventh week of the 2018-19 NBA season. So there you guys have it, those were the 10 best sneakers in the NBA from the past week. Let me know which of these pairs is your favorite in the comment section below. And be sure to subscribe to the channel for new episodes of NBA Kicks every single Monday. All you gotta do is click my logo over here to your left, hit that notification bell so you never miss an episode. If you enjoyed this episode, give this video a like, that helps me out a ton. My name is Jaren, it's from Great Avenue, catch you in the next one. Peace!